Welcome back to Loki Tech. Today I'm gonna review this M.2 heatsink from Josbo. This M.2 heatsink only costs about five bucks. This heatsink also looks very big and it's also cover the bottom layer of the NVMe. Okay, let's just unbox this heatsink and we will test it with my Kingston KC2500. I test using crystal this mark three times run. Unfortunately, I put my NVMe at second slot which only has X2 speed and halving my NVMe performance. Most of B550 motherboard only have X2 speed for second NVMe slot. As we can see, the temperature dropped by 18 degrees Celsius when applying the heat sink. It's massive reduction compared without heat sink. From the result I get, using this uh, Judge Bow N2 heat sink, you can cool down the KC2500 up to 18 degrees Celsius. And this one, you I'm not peel out the warranty sticker from the NVMe 
Well, there are two issues from this M.2 heatsink. The first is, if you have two layer uh, M.2 like my KC2500, you will have struggle when installing it with the stock thermal pad. You need to press the thermal pad un uh, until it's thin enough and then you can fit it in this case. Uh, like, like my KC2500, I have a little bit difficulty when installing it. I need to press the stock uh, thermal pad and then it can fit. The second problem is this M.2 heatsink is quite tall, so you cannot fit it uh, at NVMe slot below the GPU. You need to put in elsewhere outside the GPU slot. Overall, this M.2 and VME heatsink from Jonesbo is really worth for 5 bucks. Can cool down so much heat for your NVMe. Okay, that's all from me. If you like this video, please press like and subscribe. And don't forget to check the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.